The year is 2002 and it's my 8th birthday. I don't remember much about that day except for my parents taking me to the garage and surprising me. It got stolen immediately. About a month later my parents bought me a new bike. I was grateful to have it, but I didn't like the color. I fell in love with my bike. It felt like I had the freedom to go anywhere. My cousins lived in the neighborhood, so sometimes I would ride over to their house. One day I parked my bike in the garage, and when I came back outside, it was gone. But this time was different, because I knew exactly who stole it. It was local bully, Perion Snow. I was too embarrassed to tell my parents my bike had been stolen again, so I set out to get it back on my own. I watched as he rode my sloppily painted bike around the neighborhood as if it were his own. There is nothing more satisfying than taking back what's yours. I was biking so fast, I'll never understand how he caught up to me. As I watched him right away, all I could think was, I guess maybe I am lucky that he didn't have the time to properly beat me up. I walked home crying and finally told my mom that my bike had been stolen. Of course I left out my attempt to get it back. A couple days later she saw Perry on riding my bike, and then called the cops. They returned my bike to me, but Perion had stolen one peg off of it. After he tagged our house, my parents decided the neighborhood was getting too bad. And just like that, Perion had successfully stolen my bike, my neighborhood, my friends, everything. We moved into a new neighborhood, and I eventually made new friends. Perion hadn't crossed my mind in almost a decade, until one day when I was driving around the old neighborhood. I parked outside of his house and thought about what I should do next. As I sat in my car, I finally realized what he meant when he said, You're lucky. I was lucky enough that my parents could buy me a bike, or two, so I never had to go steal one. In the end, I was lucky, and I guess in a weird way, Perion taught me to be thankful for everything that I have.